My name is Paul Weyers. I work at the Energy Research Center of the Netherlands. We work with 80 researchers on the lowering of the cost of solar electricity. And we do that by trying to improve the performance of solar panels, by reducing the production costs and by extending the lifetime. In my group, Module Technology, we are with 17 people working on new module technologies. Uh, we started in 2005 with a small group, mainly focusing on new module technologies. So it's all about packaging, lower costs, higher performance, and trying to work on the newer technologies. The advantage of this cell concept that we're talking about now is that it has a higher efficiency because we have less metal cover on the front of the cell. That means that more light can get access to the cell and that the efficiency increases. The solar cell, it's a so-called back contact solar cell. Uh, what's so special about it is that it's completely different from how cells are being made today. Um, and especially the way we package it. So we look very carefully to how it's done in the, the semiconductor world in, in, with back contact, so the, 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 the flip chip assembly methods. And we try to identify methods to, to do the same thing for modules. And why did we want to do that? That's because we need, needed to make drastic cost reductions. And with this technology, that seems to be very well feasible. This particular solar cell design will be commercialized by a Dutch company called Solant. Furthermore, we think that between 2015 and 2020, solar electricity will become competitive at the consumer price level in most of Europe.